Hi guys, welcome to Electric Radiators Direct, the home of electric heating. Today we're going to be looking at calculating the wattage for your electric radiators, what it means and why it's important, so that you can get the most out of your heating. Before we get into it, be sure to give this video a like, hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell for more electric heating content. First, let me explain what I mean by wattage. This refers to the maximum output of electricity that your radiator generates, which is why when browsing for your new electric radiator, it's completely normal for one style to come up in six sizes, or with their own dimensions and wattages. This is because electric radiators don't come as a one-size-fits-all heating solution. And why would they when every home is different? A country cottage will have different heating needs than a newly built apartment. And since we've got radiators spanning from as low as 300 watts all the way up to 2,400, it's safe to say Electric Radiators Direct has you covered. But why does knowing your radiator's wattage matter anyway? The answer is simple, the wrong wattage and you run the risk of insufficiently heating a room. The good news is it's super easy to avoid this. Got a tape measure? Your first port of call when working out wattage is getting your room's measurements. All you need to do is multiply the length and the width of the room to find out its area. For example, let's say your bedroom is three meters by three meters. Times that together and that leaves you with an area of nine square meters. If you hop on over to our website, you'll find all our radiators have their heat up to areas listed as well as wattage. These results reflect rooms with both modern and poor insulation. Now, insulation is an important aspect to consider when calculating wattage. It's not enough to simply know the size of the room you need to heat. If that room has, for example, really high ceilings and single glazed windows, then chances are your radiators are going to have to work harder to heat the entire space. The opposite is also true. If your room is well insulated and south facing, you'll be better suited opting for a lower wattage. So it's important you check the heat up to areas for both poor and modern insulation before making your selection. The lower value is for poor insulation and the higher value is for modern insulation. So keep this in mind when selecting your radiator. As you can see, the calculations can get a little complicated, which is why we've made things easier for you. Electric Radiators Direct's wattage calculator aims to give the right wattage for your space. Simply click the link in the description and answer a few quick questions about your property. Insulation, room size and location, they all play into it. The calculator will then tell you the minimum total watts required for your room of choice. However, it is important to remember that this is simply an approximation and you should always double check the heat up to values before choosing your product. You don't need just one radiator either. Say your room requires a 1200 watt radiator, what you could do is select two 600 watt radiators instead. This way you aren't limited by the wall space available or the physical size of your radiator. Remember, you should never underspecify your wattage if you think it might save you money. If you find you're on the border between two sizes, we always recommend going with the higher wattage. Not only will it ensure a more efficient experience, it'll also help to extend the life of your radiator. With your newfound knowledge, you can browse our extensive range of heaters at electricradiatorsdirect.co.uk, knowing exactly what you need for ultimate efficiency. Because electric radiators are built with efficiency at the forefront, they don't always have to run at full wattage. As standard, all of our electric radiators come with precision digital thermostats, which accurately and automatically maintain temperatures to within a fraction of a degree. This way, you never run the risk of underheating your space. Make sure you look out for other energy saving features too, including weekly programming, Wi-Fi app control, open window detection and motion detection. With the right size radiator and advanced functionality to match, your heating will always run smoothly and efficiently. Of course, calculating your wattage is just one part of choosing the right electric radiator for your space. For further guidance, why not take a look at our other video, Buying an Electric Radiator, The Complete Guide. So there you have it. You now have the tools to help you calculate the wattage for your electric radiators. Any questions or comments, let us know down below. Don't forget to like this video, hit that subscribe button and tap the notification bell. See you next time.